Joseph, aka King Charisma, aka the Charismatic Wonder Man, aka Chicka 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 Black Some Shady. How y'all doing? Welcome to another new episode of Unboxing Sessions. If you missed my last episode, we unboxed the Indiana Jones 4 movie collection, which include Raiders of the Lost Ark, Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom, Indiana Jones, The Last Crusade, and Indiana Jones and the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull in 4K Ultra HD. Um, if you missed that episode, definitely check that out before you watch um, this episode because there was some um, pretty good goodies in there. And I know you guys like um, watching me unbox those goodies, so definitely check that out. For tonight's episode on session number 139, we are going to unbox another gaming console. So I know um, the past couple episodes I unboxed the Xbox Series X gaming console. And I was pretty intrigued to get it because, you know, being a fan of the Xbox since 2009, you know, it was really interesting to be able to upgrade from the 360 to the Xbox One to the Xbox One X to now the Series X. Well, um, apparently we're going to be upgrading another next-gen console. Um, I remember getting the, my first console was the PlayStation 1. And I remember my dad buying that for me. I was like four or five years old, I think. Um, and I remember playing that, um, my first gaming console. And I was really intrigued and impressed with the games. As you know, I am trying to be a video game designer. And I was really um, excited to buy this next-gen console, especially um, trying to get into gaming. And you're probably wondering, well, what gaming console are we talking about? Well, we are going to unbox, and I know this is a gaming console that everybody wants, but it's limited. We are going to unbox the PlayStation 5 gaming console. And this thing is humongous. Um, if I remember correctly, you're going to have 825 gigabytes. So that's a downside, um, I know, for PlayStation um, players because it's not going to have one terabyte like the Xbox Series X. Um, so that's kind of a bummer, but you can upgrade on memory if you have a custom SSD. That's the cool thing about it. Um, you get to be able to have a custom CPU and an SSD that makes the um, games load up faster and play better. Um, cool thing is if you have uh, the, PS, the PlayStation 5 headphones, um, you have 3D audio technology, so you hear more of the um, sounds from the game, so that's pretty nice. And you get a pretty cool DualShock controller, um, which is pretty nice. Um, so you get um, haptic feedback when you play a certain games, so it feels like you're actually in the game. So that's pretty nice. So you're probably wondering what's in this bad boy. Well, I'm going to show you, so let's get started, shall we? Okay, so here is all the components for the PlayStation 5 gaming console. Um, I kind of did a TikTok earlier, um, you know, um, displaying my unboxing. So that's why I didn't want to like go and take it out the box and do it because I knew it was going to take a long time just to, you know, get things done. So I apologize if y'all couldn't see the actual full um, unboxing experience, but um, you can check out my TikTok video for this. Um, at King Kev 25 that's on TikTok. Make sure you give that a follow and a like. Um, but anyway, yeah, here are the components for the uh, PlayStation 5 gaming console. So um, here you got your two manuals. You got your quick start guide showing you um, things to get you ready to um, start up your system. Can't wait to start this bad boy up. Uh, to later on today then you got your safety guide just letting you know about safety stuff you know like make sure you don't play too long you know since it hurts your eyes and your head so make sure you keep that safety guide in hand then it's going to come with a stand the cool part i like about the uh, playstation 5 since everyone keeps saying that it looks like a um 
wireless router, which it kind of does, or a modem, is it comes with a stand. So you can put this on the stand so you can stand your PlayStation um, system up. So that's pretty neat. Um, so I really can't wait to put this stand on. Then you got your cables. Um, I, got, I guess you got your USB cable. Then you got your power supply cable. And then you got your HDMI 2.0 cable. So, yeah, you definitely need those to hook this bad boy up. Then you got the special controller that everyone is dying to get their hands on. This is the Dual Shock 5 controller, I believe. Um, this is the one that has haptic feedback um, and it has a built in microphone, so that's pretty cool. Um, the design of it looks pretty amazing. Um, even though the white to me, I would prefer a different color, but um, hopefully I'll get some more controllers for it. Um, but it does have a great feel to it. It has a good texture. Very different from the Xbox Series X controller that had a more rough feel to it. But with this one, it feels really smooth. So I'll just show it to y'all. Got the back. So that's pretty nice. So can't wait to use that. Can't wait to use that. So yep, that is the um sorry about that. That is the dual shock controller. And last but not least, the final part is the PlayStation 5 itself. And I'll stand it up. I'm just going to be very careful cuz you know this cost about $500. Um this is limited by the way. Um so uh, for anyone asking me, how did I get it? Again, there is a guy named Max Swider. Um, he was the guy that helped me get the Xbox Series X from GameStop. He will help you be able to let you know like when restocks hit. But other than that, um, definitely check him out at Matt Swider on Twitter. That's pretty cool. If you follow him and you turn on the bell signal for the... Um, for Twitter, he will let you know when certain restocks hit. But um, other than that, yep, this is the PlayStation 5 and the components. So, yep, that's that. Sorry, guys, I forgot to do a, one little pointer. I just wanted to show you the display of how it looks with the stand. Um, as you can see at the bottom... I know it's really hard to see, but at the bottom, that is the uh, stand for the PlayStation 5 that I showed earlier. And I hooked it up. It wasn't really hard to hook up, but it's pretty simple as one, two, three. So, yeah, the display of it looks pretty amazing. So, I'm really happy I got this system. Can't wait to play it, see how it feels. But, yeah, I just wanted to show how it looks and like how the box matches with how the controller and the console looks. It looks pretty amazing. I will say you can play up to 8K gaming on here. Um, you can play 4K with 120 frames per second, has HDR. And um, any PlayStation 4 games that you have, 99% of those games you can play on the PlayStation 5. It will look and play better. So, yes, definitely get your hands on one of these bad boys. It is limited, just letting you know, but if you can get your hands on it, you will be a happy person. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. So, I hope you guys enjoy me unboxing the PlayStation 5 gaming console. Just want to um, recap on everything. Like I said, you're going to get two different guides. You're going to have the quick start guide to show you how to set up the console you're going to have a safety guide just telling you safeties when using this console um let me see you got your cables so you have your um usb cable i guess you hook up to your controller you have your power supply cable you have your hdmi 2.0 cable so it helps you with 4k gaming and everything like that um when you play it through the uh, playstation 5 you're gonna also have these. Now you're gonna have this awesome DualShock controller. 
And last but not least, you're gonna have the console itself, the PlayStation 5, that comes with a uh, black stand, so you can stand it up when you're playing. Um, you can also hook it up horizontally. Um, the guide will show you how to um, set that up, but I prefer to have it up because it just looks better and it looks cool and it looks like a wireless router. I know I said before that the Xbox Series X looks like a um, mini fridge, while well, this one looks like a um, wireless router. So anyway, that uh, concludes another great episode of Unboxing Sessions. I hope you enjoyed that episode. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also follow me at King Charisma 27 on Instagram, at King Charisma 27 on Twitter, at King Charisma 22 on Snapchat, and at King Kev 25 on TikTok, very important. Like I said, I did a um, two-part um, video for my TikTok, so definitely check that out. That's uh, discussing this um, episode, so definitely check that out and give that a big follow. Um, what I was gonna say, um, Patreon, please, 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 Follow me on Patreon and uh, donate between a dollar and five dollars for me because I will be putting out exclusive content later on this year. I know I've been saying that every year, but I really mean it. I know I just, I've been very busy working, um, but once I have more of the time, I will be able to put out more exclusive content. And as being a Patreon on my channel, I forgot to mention, you're getting exclusive access to certain things. Um, there will be special contests going on for special um, members and stuff like that. So just um, just think about that um, before you follow me and donate. So definitely do that for me um, if you do get a chance. Uh, what I was going to say, music videos and stuff that's coming soon. I know I haven't been um, in the move, the grooving mood when it comes to music. Uh, I've been very busy working but I will be getting to music and I can't wait to put out new music videos this year, especially around the spring and summertime. So I'm definitely cannot wait once I get a new laptop. Uh, other than that, hope you enjoyed that episode and I cannot wait to play this bad boy. So now I have two next gen consoles, the Xbox Series X and the PlayStation 5. So I am a happy man. Um, I cannot wait to play it and I will give you my thoughts. Oh, one more thing. I am selling my PlayStation 4, and I will be selling it for about um, $275. So if you want to get this, please, 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 please message me um, through YouTube or any social media accounts. That would be great because I am going to be selling it and I'll most likely be sold hopefully around the middle of March. Um, so definitely uh, get in touch with me as soon as possible. Otherwise, I will have to sell through GameStop and get whatever I can. But by selling it from you, but by me selling my console to one of you guys, that would be great. And plus, you could save money up to get a PlayStation Five when you can. So think about that. Um, other than that, I hope you enjoyed that episode, and I'll see y'all next time. Another episode of Unboxing Sessions. If you smell what the king is cooking, talk to y'all later. Bye-bye.